hi guys so the next exam CA foundation is mathematics so normally mathematics is the third paper but since accounts exam has gotten postponed now maths is our second paper let me give you a few quick tips of what to uh, do in the maths exam how to attempt it let me tell you some big mistakes which students do in a maths exam now maths exam is of 100 marks and we have two hours to solve the question paper right and it is fully MCQs right multiple choice questions hundred of them the biggest mistake which students do is answering the questions in the order that is answering first question then going to second then going to third and so on don't do that mistake of answering the questions in order then how should you answer <coughs> you should answer in three rounds in the first round what you do you read the first question if you think you know it you solve it go to the second question second question let's say is from a topic which you are not very comfortable let's say the second question is from differentiation or integration which you don't like don't even waste time reading that question that will be covered in the second round so in the first round what do we do we go to questions which we are super confident upon why this approach is adopted because majority students keep going in order first question second question is very bad question tough question they don't know but they will waste time in doing it third question easy they will do it fourth question is tough and they don't know still they will waste time on it in the end of the exam they are finished with like 100 and uh, let's say 100 questions they are done with 70 questions 30 questions are still left and they have hardly 5 minutes time in that 30 questions there may be 10 questions or 15 questions which are very easy which they could have done but now there is no time so what do we do we answer maths exam in three rounds round number one most easy questions which we are super confident first question easy do it second difficult leave third difficult leave don't even waste time reading the question second third fourth skip fifth question i know this question do it sixth little difficult leave seventh little difficult leave eighth question easy do it so in the first round maybe you will be able to do only 20 or 30 questions out of the 100 but you get those 20 30 marks very quickly now you go to the second round second round is again you start from the beginning this time you go to those questions only which you have left and when you're doing the second round again do those questions which you think you know which you can try and you'll get the answer suppose there's a particular topic question which you did not study at all which has to be taken a guess or too much time has to be wasted that can be kept for the third round so first round the easiest questions second round slightly difficult but you know that you can do it if you put some time into it third round is the most difficult questions which you are not confident on this way you will get to answer all the questions which you know if you go order wise answering you will not answer some questions at all which you might be knowing but you don't have time that is the secret to maths exam second second is do not answer a question unless you are 60 70 percent sure about it because CA foundation level has negative marking you might lose on the negative marking so you should even answer a question only if you are 60 to 70 percent sure otherwise don't answer it leave it 50 50 don't take a chance mostly it might be wrong make sure you do that also it's not necessary that you answer all the hundred cool because uh, we need to pass correct negative marking can eat into our scores and it might be dangerous so answer a question only if you are 70 percent sure at least i hope you have checked your calculators that they are working fine also the last minute preparation practice focus on things which you already know properly don't try to now understand things which you have not touched at all i am sure some commerce students have a problem with maths as such as a subject do not worry focus on logical reasoning 20 marks easy there's no great formulas or there's no mathematics or statistics logic so focus on revising logical reasoning questions mathematics focus on time value of money questions of course it depends how comfortable you are <clears throat> normally when i teach my students i teach calculator shortcuts which give them easy 10 to 12 marks in time value of money questions so practice those questions as well when you are revising most importantly as always with every exam do not panic 
panic is the worst thing play it like a video game go there two hours sit through it clean shot once that's it but go through these three rounds great done all the very best for cf foundation december 20 maths exam hope all of you do well signing off bye bye